Another new reel for 2021 introduced this year is the Shimano Xsense with some upgrades over the previous gen, which I absolutely adored. Lightweight, powerful, beautiful with the matte black. So let's see the new one, what they've done to it, what they've continued to put into it and see if it's a reel that might work for you. When we talk about the Hagane concept with Shimano, this is a reel that does not fall short in any one category. From the Hagane gear, which I actually have one here, this is an actual micro module to Hagane gear. This is what it looks like. This is a cold forged aluminum drive gear. The cool thing about this gear is it's actually stamped out of a block of aluminum and it's the strongest way to produce a gear without uh, affecting the quality of the metal. So it's not cut with a laser or by heat or grind or it's not even poured liquid like you do see some with zinc cast gears. This is a one shot aluminum cold forge drive gear and this is really the heart of the Hagane system. Other thing they've done is Hagane body. The body on Xsense is actually magnesium so super high rigidity but incredibly lightweight and strong. So that is another thing part of Hagane. So you've got the gear and you've got the body. And the last piece of the puzzle is X-Ship. It's that double bearing supported pinion gear, which is also available on the 2021 X-Sense. While we're talking about the insides of the body, there's a few more features in it that you should know about. Silent drive has also been added. And what that is, is where they've taken the area of the gearing. So between the pinion gear and the drive gear and all the things that work together inside that body. And they've really reduced the gaps. So they've increased tolerances so that it's tighter fitting. And what that does is it eliminates a lot of the sound that traditionally happens when you have gaps between gearing. That whirring sound when you spin a spinning reel is really gone. But it's also about improving power transmission and longevity of your gears. So this is all part of that Hagane concept and then they've added silent drive. When we talk about bearings, 11 plus 1 SARB bearings, and this right here in my hand is a Shimano SARB bearing, shielded anti-rust bearing. So this also makes this reel perfect, whether you're fishing inshore saltwater or you're fishing freshwater, uh, damp environments, or you're in a place where the reel's going to get wet, no problem. Shielded anti-rust bearings, 11 plus 1 in the Xsense. Other quiet features about that reel on the bottom side is that G-free body, which really brings the mass of the reel or the weight inside the body up above the handle gets it closer to the hand and that makes it more comfortable for the angler to hold less fatigue throughout the day better balance in the setup or in the combo so another thing g free body is in the 2021 xsense as we slide up from the body and into the rotor, there's another area that separates Xsense from a lot of reels. Shimano really recently started splitting up the spinning reel categories. There's core solid like Stratic FL or Otegra, and then there is MGL or Magnum Light series reels, which are much like Xsense and Vanford. And where that happens is with that CI4 Magnum Light rotor. You've got a very lightweight rotor that takes almost nothing to get going, to get started. So it's all about low startup inertia when we talk about Magnum Light Reels. And where that benefits you as an angler is in those start and stop retrieves when you're finesse fishing. There is zero effort to either start or stop that rotor from turning. And what that does is it allows you to work incrementally very fine, minute presentations in that finesse world. Perfect perfect scenario. If you pick one up and spin it, I just, I'm going to challenge all of you. Go grab a Stratic FL or a, and a Vanford and spin them and see which one's harder to start up and easier to stop. It's undeniable that when the rotor has more mass, it takes more effort to get it to start and it definitely takes more effort to get it to stop. And that's where the MGL Magnum Light rotors really, really reign supreme. When we head up to the spool, there's a few things on this spool that are, you don't often hear talked about. So, uh, rigid support drag. Now that is basically a reinforcement where the spool meets the shaft and what that does is when you have hard pulling fish or you're applying lots of drag, drag pressure, it makes sure that drag is always going to come out evenly, smoothly, at a consistent pace. It's not going to end up cantering or you know tilting the spool under heavy load. That extra support really makes sure that drag performs no matter how much heat you're putting on a fish or how much heat the fish is putting on you. Another thing, rapid fire drag, so you can tell when you click the top of it, you can engage that drag rather quickly in those finesse situations where you start light or have to back a drag off under a hard running fish with very light line. Cross carbon drag is also in the 2021 Xsense and it kicks out both 20 in the 3000 size and 24 pounds of drag in the 4000 size. 
When we talk about the spool, the Xsense also has propulsion line management, that angled uh, lip on the spool that helps with casting performance and line management. And then it also has the long stroke spool, which has been brought down. Again, something that started with Stella. We saw it in Twin Power. We've seen it in Stratic FL and Vanford and now in Altegra. It is also in the 2021 Xsense. And that is a 10% taller spool. And what that does is really when you're casting, it forces the line to change directions less times. It's better line management, better casting distance. And lastly, when it comes to the casting and line maintenance part, Xsense also runs Shimano's Aero Wrap 2, which means the line or the spool will go up, slow, down fast, or it's one of those two. And what that does is it creates a crisscross on your line. So when you're fishing super lines like Power Pro, this is going to make sure you get a cross pattern because when your drag is locked and you're setting the hook and your line is level like this, when you set the hook, that line can cut in and bind inside the spool. But that Aero Wrap 2 creates that little micro cross hatching of your line to make sure that line does not bite in and get caught underneath. The worst case scenario when you're finesse fishing would be that happening. Aero Wrap 2 really helps reduce that. Now, lastly, I said salt water and most people freak out. They hear magnesium, they hear salt water. Uh, <clears throat> this thing does have SARB bearings, 11 plus one, like I mentioned, but it also has X-Protect. And X-Protect is a labyrinth system. Let's call it a maze to get water, to stop going into vital areas or vulnerable areas in a reel without adding heavy rotational feel to the reel. This is a labyrinth system that has come down from Shimano Stella all the way down and we're seeing this more pervasively through the entire lineup. X-Protect is an incredible way to make sure you can keep that reel working at its peak performance and not have that salt water, that nasty, nasty salt water get into vital areas and wreak havoc inside the body. So for the stats of this reel, for all you geeks out there like me, uh, this one is really only available, unlike most Shimano reels that come from 500 or 1000 size up to 5000 size, it's available in two sizes, the Xsense. sense It is available in a 3000 HG model and a 4000 XG. What are the differences? The HG model is available in a six to one gear ratio, and that is 35 inches of line per handle turn, and that's the 3000. The 4000, which has a bigger spool, is a 6.2 to 1, but brings in 40 inches of line per handle turn. So really, if you're looking for more speed, I would recommend going to the 4000. Most people worry about that because they worry as you get into a 4000 reel, they get a little heavier. This is the amazing part when you have an MGL reel, uh, an MGL spool with a magnesium body is you get dramatically reduced weight. The weight of the 3000 is 6.3 ounces. The weight of the 4000, it's only 7.8 ounces. In comparison, a Stratic FL 3000 or an Altegra 3000 weigh in at around 7.9 ounces. The 4000 Xsense weighs a little bit less than either of those reels in a 3000 size. So now you don't have to sacrifice weight with size. You can get the speed, you get the bigger spool, line pickup, inches of line per handle turn, and still maintain that light weight with lots of drag pressure. And retail, $779, $799, it is a premium reel, but it comes with a boatload of premium features. That is the new 2021 Xsense from Shimano. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Please subscribe to my channel. I'll be doing more and more of these gear reviews and deep dives for you guys. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys are all doing well and we'll see you on the next one.